Welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. We are at the dig site where we last left off. Which is uh, where uh, Ted Farrow's buried, I guess. Man, I don't know where he is now. And so is the no, so is CEO. <laughs> I love that. CEO. CEO. Alright, I see a workbench. Where was that at? I saw it here. Saw a question mark over here. Here it is. Oh, it's my stash and a workbench. Nice. Let's see if we can make anything here. Outfit upgrades. What can I upgrade? Oh, this. I need to sell that. What the hell do I need that for? Okay, we, we ain't doing nothing there. Let's craft some ammo. If we can, we should be able to. We should have quite a good stockpile of stuff now. I don't know. My shards are all pretty good. Almost 5,000 shards. That's nice for a change. Uh, hunter arrows. Terror precision arrows. Let's plop a few more of those in the backpack. But we have none of these. Okay, we gotta have these. And my shards will go down now. Hmm. Okay. Uh, precision arrows, we can make another five of those. I really screwed up by not using the... Um, I realized that when I watched the video back. Fighting the Apex Thunderjaw, I should have used my acid shredders because he was weak to acid. I should have popped a couple of notes in his butt. But I didn't because I just wasn't paying attention. Okay, all of that stuff's good. Looks pretty good. I know what I want to make. Can I make potions here? Potion crafting. Let's make some potions. Except I need to get rid of some because I need to make... I need to make some of these. Stamina potions. Uh, I have cleanse potions. I've got four of those. I don't need four of those. I do not need five of these. If I can get the cleanse down to three and get this down to three, that would open up three slots for large stamina potions. So let's sell some potions if I can. Is there a guy here? Grab some stuff out of my stash. Got a thousand health in there now. Okay, so is there somebody to sell stuff here? I don't see anybody here to sell stuff to. This is a weird area. Bless you. You can't... I mean... Did they ever open up an, uh, an ammo guy here? I have a workbench now. There's a workbench there. They do not have a weapons trader here. Very bizarre. I don't know why. Alright, well let's save here. And then let's, uh, I'm going to go sell some stuff. Let's just go here. Here? Right here. Campfire. Let's go there. We need to sell some stuff. This guy disappeared. I swear it sure seemed like this guy should have been a weapons dealer, but he's gone. Who do we got? We got this guy to sell stuff too. Does he have more stuff? Hmm, not really. I'm looking... Well, actually, this stuff probably isn't too bad. The Grave... The Great Utara Grave Singer. That actually looks pretty good. A 21, 20, 20... Oh, not really flame resistant, though, is it? It's not bad, though. It's got a lot of good stuff on it. What else we've got? A <laughs> Dracoon. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny looking, sorry. Osram Vanguard. Little health melee Valoran impact. The Carja Trader. What does that do for me? Trap limit. Skilled salvager. Shard salvager. Yeah, I mean you're not gonna use that when you're out wandering around. Alright, let's sell some stuff. Uh resources. What do we got? What's 
this? Corruptor primary nerve, huh? So I hope I don't see a whole lot more corruptors. Oh, I almost got a thousand bucks for that. That's pretty good. That pushes my shard count up kind of nicely. Um, I don't know. Can I sell that freaking dumbass thing they gave me? No, oh, I cannot sell that, can I? Yeah, this one here. Um, is that any good? I don't think it's any good for anything. Stamina regen. Valor Surge Master is two. My Valor, I don't have Valor Surge Master on this one. I have it on this one is one. Valor Surge Master two is on this one, the Vindicator. And this is Silent Range, and this is a Valor Surge Master of one. So I don't know if it makes sense to keep that. It's worth 200 shards. Um, yeah, we'll keep it for now. Might need that. Might need those shards later. I was going to sell. I can't sell. I can sell potions. Let's sell two of these. And one of these. Okay, so now I can make some more potions. I need some, need some uh, stamina potions. So let's go do that. You seek. No. Yeah, I seek weapons. Apparently you guys don't have any weapons. Where was it? Uh, potions. There's a workbench here somewhere. Where is it? There it is. Oh, wait a minute. This guy has question mark now. Sure. Maybe he'll sell me a weapon now or something. Or he's got a mission that I've got to do so I can buy stuff from him. Alright, potions. Let's craft some potions. This here we want to craft. One. Two. Three. Nice. That's a nice setup. Okay, we're good. Alright, let's see what this dipship wants. Because if he's going to sell me weapons, that's what I want to do. Ancestor. Please. Ancestor. It's about my brother. I don't mean to disturb you, but I've run my request through every channel and I've gotten nowhere. Just take me through it. Apologies. My name is Jomar. I'm the weapons officer for this expedition. It's my job to ensure the troops are armed and prepared for what's out there. Great, tell me something. And I've failed to do so. My younger brother, Oris, his unit was sent to scout the tower on the northern side of the island. They should have returned by now. The overseer has denied my request for a search party. Hmm. And defying him would mean dismissal. Or worse. You think they might be alive? Horace has been obsessed with San Francisco ever since I can remember. He jumped at the chance to join this expedition. I have to believe that fate isn't cruel enough to make this place his tomb. If you help me, I'll get you access to any weapon in my stock. There we go. If I make my way up north, I'll look for your brother. Thank you. If it helps, my brother carried an ancestral relic with him. I believe your focus might be able to pick it up. Hmm. What kind of relic? A small metal piece dangling from a chain with a hologram of San Francisco, <laughs> which is why my brother always had it with him. The diviners speculated it was some kind of beacon inviting the ancestors to visit the city. Speculated? So there was data on it they couldn't read? It was deemed lost knowledge. If my brother truly is gone, could you maybe bring the relic back for me? It meant so much to Oris. I, I'd like to keep it safe for him. We'll do, dude. We'll get them. We'll get it back. Okay. Let's see. Where is this at? The souvenir, level thirty. That's up here by the sun wings, huh? Landfall for the Quen Scouts. Okay, it's not far from. Here. Well, it kind of is. What's this? Oh, there's a black box there. Okay. Well, we haven't been here yet, right? This stuff is unknown. Unknown. For some reason, the black box is not unknown. Okay, so this was where the party was. It was in here, and then this is the... That's the place there. Okay, and I also wanted to go check this out. I'm guessing this is a crazy situation here. 
but we should go. Is this an unknown campfire? It is. All right, how do I, what's the closest way to get there? Um, here, I guess. Well, there's another exclamation point in here. Where's it at? Uh, let's go find this one, too. If I'm going to be out and about, I might be able to pick up a couple things going down the road, eh? Tell me, what's your problem? I am the savior. We'll find a way home. Here I am. We're never getting that gyro compass back. Uh -oh. We're stuck here. For good. The ancestor reborn. May we be led to truth. Just, Aloy, <laughs> what's this I hear about you never going back home? Our navigational ships. They're all gone. Destroyed by storms and reefs, and with them the one instrument we need to guide us across the ocean. There is one ship that might still hold a working gyro compass. Uh -oh. But it's beyond our reach, beached on an island surrounded by deadly currents. No compass, no way home, no way back to those we should have never left behind in the first place. Christia. Okay, let's go through the whole dealio here. You mentioned you left someone behind? My uh, wife, Neandra. She works the field in the Great Delta. When I was chosen for this mission, she begged me not to come. She was scared I wouldn't return. Hmm. And like always, she was right. I left without saying goodbye, and now I won't ever see her again. Oh, come on. So you two are soldiers? Navigators. Yeah, I was going to say, they ain't soldiers. I'm Harriam. And this is Christy. <laughs> They're navigators so and they lost their compass. Okay. Instrument? The gyro compass. Only I know how to read it. The diviners trained me. Harriam was chosen to memorize the charts found in the legacy. So you can't navigate the fleet without each other? It is the Quen way. The greater the knowledge held by one person alone, the greater the risk it'll be used against the Empire should we be captured by our enemies. Hmm. Your tribe sure is cautious. All right, what else we got? A gyro compass. So what is this gyro compass you're looking for? It's a device used by the ancestors to help pinpoint a ship's location. But it only works if the readings are compared to a chart. How'd you get your hands on something like that? I guess it's safe to tell you since you carry the gift of the ancestors. The diviners found them on ancient vessels back in our homeland and modified them so we could use them on our ships. Without them, we're at the mercy of the seas. Okay. Where's the beach ship at? You said what you need is on a ship somewhere. Yes. The ship we were stationed on. The night we approached landfall, a sudden squall hit the fleet. While some ships managed to find safe harbor here, ours ran aground. The crew abandoned ship, hoping the ocean would spare us. I thought we'd drown for sure. Thank the ancestors, we somehow got washed up on a beach southwest of here. Scouts found us and brought us to landfall. Not that it matters. The only ship with the gyro compass is grounded and surrounded by deadly currents. Oh, I can swim through those deadly currents. Maybe I can help. Not unless you can fly. Maybe. I can't do that. Not yet. But if I find a way, I'll come back. Okay, She's another... She's an ancestor reborn. Another flying thing. Maybe she really can help. I will not let myself hope just yet, but... I thank you for your kindness. All right, so we gotta find out how to get this flying gizmo going, I guess. It's finally changed. So that's gonna be a. Yeah, we gotta do the wings of the ten. Wherever that's at, I have no idea. But we'll get that, I guess. All right, so we got a corruptor. That was. Uh, we have one machine left, huh? We don't know. Maybe that's probably the final boss or something. Who knows? Got this. All kinds of good data points we found. And the last thing, okay. Alright, so. Yeah, we can't fly anywhere. That's just kind of a pain in the butt. Uh, let's see. We want to go here. We want to go there, which means I want to. Okay, let's get to a campfire so I can just. I don't think I can get to that ship. No, you can't. Not yet. Not now. Oh, is that a ship over there? That's pretty cool. 
There's a whole bunch of ships out there. That looks like a, a freaking cruise ship or something. <laughs> Remnants of one. Alright, let's go to look at the, uh, the, task, the ruin, the relic ruin, and see what kind of jigsaw puzzle they got over there. That is, um... Uh, let's see, what's the best way to get there? With all those question marks there. I think this one's the best one. Let's go here. All those question marks, man. That looks just like either it's a bunch of flowers or a bunch of fire gleam or... Alright, where are we going? Let's get rid of the quest though I've got right now. Gemini, return to base. We're not going to do that just yet. So let's mark this up here. Right there. Okay, where are we going? Where to, you, baby? For some reason I've lost my compass. There it is. This way? Oh, then there's a drone too. Now we're not going to mess with the drone. Um. Going the wrong way. We gotta go this way. Never tell what this thing's doing. Um, let's see. And also gotta watch out for the frickin' dam. Can I go through here? Yeah, it looks a little dicey going through there. Guess we'll. S don't jump in the water. Let's go this. We'll stay on the road. Sun in my eyes again. Let's get some health or something going here. What do we got? Where's the health at? Let's stick that on there for now. This isn't where the frickin' damn stalkers are, is it? There's some crap going on over there. Okay. Can't take much damage from fire. And we got a charger over there. Okay. okay. This is not the stalker area, is it? The no, stalker area is over here. Okay. that guy. He's getting, he's getting double teamed, huh? Oh well. You should learn how to pick a fight, dude. Something's got me. Who are those machines attacking? Alright. Do we want to get involved? I guess we do. It sounds like we do. Ancestor, if they brought you here, it must be to save Loras. To who? She's trapped up in this tower. Part of the route she climbed collapsed. I should be able to climb that tower. I could help that trapped soldier. Loras! Zobek is here! <laughs> the ancestors must have left plans for your sorry carcass. <laughs> Stop joking, Arayus. You need to help me find a way down from here. I'm not joking. The living ancestor is here. Okay, we'll come back to you, dude. Get me some ropes. I'm going this way. Sorry, I have a plan. Uh, where did my marker go? It's over here now, huh? Is this where the campfire is? Okay, we're not far from it. Oh, wide maws. Wide Maws, Claw Striders. I think that broken building is the ruin that Quinn Scout told me about. There should be a relic inside. Oh, is that, uh... Is that where those guys are? No. Is that an errand? Maybe it was an errand. Music in the metal, the souvenir. Quinn's weapon officer. Where's that at? Oh, that's way up there. Yeah, no, we're not going up there. What is that? Is that a claw strider? That's a wide maw there? I thought 
doesn't look like a wide one. It looks like a claw striker. No, he's flipping little turds out, so that's gotta be a... Oh yeah, I see his big mouth there. Okay, so we're gonna go in here. I think. Okay, this is just gonna be one giant jigsaw puzzle, isn't it? Okay, I'm in. You're Let's in where? Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff going on in here, isn't there? What's that? Vent panels. Mm. Storage the instructions. The door needs a key module and a two-part code to open. Yeah. Like I might find those things higher up. Looks like there's an ornament in there. How to get to it? That ladder could be useful. The I ladder. A way to lower it. She's always talking about stuff. Yeah, I can't lower it because I can't shoot an arrow at it from here. I should be used to it by now. Can I shoot that ladder from here, maybe? No. Probably got to get it from up above somewhere. This looks like a flower here somewhere. Where is it? It's right there. Okay, there's a little flower in there. I get to it? No. I think I'm gonna have to go up and then come down. That's kind of what it's looking like. Yeah, we gotta go up and then come down. So let's go back out to the front. So I can't go through here. That's where the metal flower is. And there's also something down below. Okay. Can't get this. I There's can't an opening in the wall behind the ladder. There's no way to stand here and shoot that ladder, is there? I no. can't shoot the lock on the ladder while I'm in the water. No, we know you can't. But can I shoot it from somewhere else, like over there? Looks like I possibly can. What good that does me, I don't know. Alright, let's go up on the outside, see what happens. we go. Come on, game. Jesus. Okay, climb up. There we go. around here no just some stuff I can skip hop skip and a jump across this is gonna be a, a doozy I can tell you that right now okay according to the data I found earlier I should be able to find half of the code in the next building and there's a way to cross over up here All right, we need this, and we also need a battery from somewhere, which means you can't carry a battery around, so you know it's got to be around here somewhere, right? Storage rack, vent panel, fire gleam on the other side of that wall. Uh, let's see. Can I get up higher? Where was that ladder? I guess it's probably on your side of the fire gleam here, right? Uh, that looks like a battery. So we should take that. It looks like it's out of power. Awesome. 
so that means it won't work over there, right? Is there a way to charge it here? Doesn't look like it. There's the fire gleam. Um, oh, where do I plug this in? I don't know. Let's go back here and see what this was back here. I don't know what this was. If it was a... This is not to power it. I mean, this is to power it. No good. Energy cells out of power. That's okay. We'll work on that. What's that over there? Charging terminal. Did I walk right by it? Can I get at the charging terminal? I can't. I walked right by it. Okay, let's do it again. Let's grab it. Go charge it. Charging. There we go. Energy cells charged up. That was fast. Hmm. Oh, looks like the cell's losing power. There's the other building, past that big hole in the wall up there. How do I get over to it? Oh, the cell's out of power. Really? I gotta charge it up again. No okay. Good. Okay. Well, hold Energy on. cell's out of power. Oh. Well, I'm not that had to hurt. The other building that way. Okay. Can I grab that uh, supply box down? I cannot. What's this? That, uh, that's not a grapple point. Of course it's not. So how do you get the charged battery over there? Energy cells are going fast. I got to get to the elevator. You have to find a quicker way to get to the elevator. Okay, what is the quicker way? There is no quicker way. Well, that's not a quick way. And I can't run with it. Let's try that one more time. Charge it. Okay, then remove it. The energy cell must be damaged. It won't hold a charge for long. Oh, damn. Too slow. Okay, so there's Move no it. way. All right, grab this thing. Just energy put it back over here. Power. Put it back over there. So that's not the way to do that. There's another way, I guess, but I don't know how you do that. I have no idea. There's no other way. You can't climb with these things or run with them, so it's like, I don't know what you do with it. We'll stick it in here for now. We'll just store it there. Alright, so... I'm trying to get out of here. Let's go back to this door I just opened up. Just jump up there and grab. Seriously, I swear. Go up. Oh, this must be the faster way to do it, huh? faster way or is that another charging thing that looks like another charging one all right so let's uh, take this out of here all right there's a few extra steps is all we're gonna get huh? is that what it is I gotta move hmm. fast the cells running out of power we're gonna juice it up over here I think
think I can make it to the elevator from here. You're gonna have to, because that's all we got. So just get your little feet moving. Come on, girl, let's go. Those couple extra steps is all it took, huh? Got it. So the elevator here, should have power now. Here's the question. You know, because me, I think about little stupid stuff like this. If the battery is weak and doesn't hold a charge for very long, why is it working right now? What difference does it make? The distance, I mean, when you plug it in there, what difference does it make? It's gonna, use, it's gonna lose its charge, right? Okay, we're gonna take the elevator up just to see what happens. I can't believe this thing still works. Me either, I wouldn't have got on it, but uh, you know, that's all we got, so. Where are we? Is this where the flower is? Oh, some more metal gleam. Or fire gleam, I mean. There's a, a little box floating right there. We've got something up there. What's that? Oh, that's the key. One of the keys. How do we get to that key module? I don't know. Let's open this up here, see what happens. did this do? Oh, this opens it up out to here. Okay. I'm not sure what that did. Let's go do a quick save here anyway, though. Don't pass. Just gotta keep me quiet. Alright, we'll do this. We're gonna, we're gonna lay a save on this. I don't know how that works, but... Alright, so now we can get in here. And... So, what did the elevator do? Did it come down? What the hell? Alright, we gotta go. I have a floating box. I don't know what that does for me. There must be... Do I need to take that box on the elevator? Can I get that out of here? Let's see. I don't know if I can get that out of here. I don't think I can. I can. Okay, well, let's just put this right here for now. We might want that for something. I don't know what, but we might want that for something. I might want it in there. Who knows? Or do I need to put it over here? I think it floats. Oh, here's the metal flower. Okay. flower shut this metal flower down bad metal flower bad metal flower so what did that do for me that kind of opens up this passage with more fire gleam over here Okay. And this is another exit. So I'm guessing that got rid of a few of the question marks. It did. Okay, so this is another exit. Alright. Okay. I get you. And is that another metal flower up there? No. We have to get up higher. And nothing has shown me how that works. Now, can I hit that lock on the ladder from here? No, I cannot. I cannot do that from here. I need to be up there somewhere. So, let's go back and look at the box. The box I pulled out of the water. 
Maybe it needs to go back in the water because there's no way. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Maybe I can shoot the lock on the ladder through an opening in the wall. Yeah, maybe. If we can find an opening in the wall. That's not wet. Okay, let's do this. Let's, uh. I knew this was going to happen anyway, but let's call this a video right here. And we'll start another video. So, if you're watching, hang in there. We're going to get it. See it.